the, the policy de decisions that have been made since your government came into power um, have really increased confidence among the companies and the Canadian companies that are here are interested in investing more. So, um, I mean, I could talk about Barrick and, and FQM, but uh, there's, there's definite interest. And uh, I know that Barrick would be very interested in talking about uh, acquiring uh, and working with the government on um, Mopan, either investing in Mopani or uh, KCM, is it? KCM, and they'd love to talk to you about their vision and uh, work on that. And uh, I can say that having seen what happened in Tanzania with Barrick, uh, they were very much able to come to a win-win uh, agreement with the government of Tanzania and really change the way that the mining was being done in the country. So I hope for the same here in terms of having a, a really mutually beneficial partnership there. We, we, are, we, are, we appreciate this relationship. Uh, we would like it to grow, we would like it to continue, um, but um, maybe at this early stage, I must also indicate that maybe it's important uh, we understand why Canada revisited, restructured our relationship. We fully understand that. Um, I think the decisions behind, uh, or the, 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 the reasoning behind that decision were truly valid. But uh, where we are now, with our government in place, with our democratic credentials, almost, almost, I, I dare say, almost uncomparable to others in this region. And uh, I'm sure you, you've done your own, your team has done their own research to batch what I'm saying. I think it's important that, uh, because we believe, both of our countries believe in democracy, and, and enhancing that and all of the positives around it.